as always, I hit every red light, known to man, but just just what we gotta deal with. Yeah, today I got the Freightliner, um, the Kenworth's in the shop, getting some repairs done. Um, but I love this Freightliner, man. It's nice, sleek. Look at this thing, fat stacks. This thing just looks nice. Look at this. Very clean, very clean. Sure, I wouldn't mind getting one of these in real life. Oh crap, I can't see. Yeah, one of these in real life would be nice. Stacks are like massive though, I ain't gonna lie. What? All right, nice and clean. Wait, oh, see, now we're gonna start. Look at the twist. This one's got the Detroit in it. Like, one of my favorite sounding motors, besides the, uh, the cat that's in the Kenworth, the Detroit's really nice. I like this one. what we can see on the way because man I I don't know Houston like that um in real life I think we've only been like uh I've been twice I think was it twice I think it's twice I think it's twice but like some of the stuff is accurate in the game some's not but it's on like a super small scale so like like look 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 at this look at this tire dude he's like I, I love seeing those. Oh, I gotta get on the highway. Yeah, buddy. Come on. A great start to the trip uh, go over oh not even not even close oh we're gonna get into a wreck oh already Jesus and then it takes forever to build back up speed in this truck come on big girl see what happens is like crazy camera angles trying to get a good camera angle and all of a sudden like you're gonna you're gonna wreck huge wreck massive fines Make it up the hill. Man, good old Texas, man. See, like, and the accuracy on this game is the cracks in, on the highway, because the temperatures fluctuate so much, that is accurate, but golly, man, I, I can only imagine how this road feels in real life. It's gotta be like, like every every like couple seconds you're hitting a bump everywhere and that's that's concrete so like i feel like that's way harder to repair than your asphalt yo oh look at this look at this thing coming up to our left oh that's clean One thing is, uh, I like seeing a lot of old school vehicles because, like, it's rare. So, when you get to see, like, an old school Ford or a Chevy and we are slowing down. Oh, crap. Wow. Look, look, look at that. Look at that. I don't, I don't know why. What was the reason for that? Yo, that would have been horrible. Like hospitalized everybody. Back to what I was saying. Yo, so 
I love seeing like the older vehicles, um, like the Chevelles, the Fords, the old Mustang, this Ford truck. I don't know if that's a, I don't remember what kind of truck that is. Uh, I know at the older F-150s, like the super old ones, I think, I think they're like that. But yeah, man, them, them older vehicles, I'm like a tuner guy, so, and now a European guy, so it's like, you know, when, when you see a nice car, it's just a nice vehicle in general. That speaks volume. Especially when, like, you take care of your stuff and don't let it run into the ground. And then you just, like, show it off. That's the best. That's the best. Because, like, we, we try to go to a whole bunch of car shows and stuff here in Florida. But, yo, with, with my schedule, nah, poop. It's poop. But, hopefully, that will change. Soon. Sooner and later. In due time. I always say in due time. Because you never know when it'll happen. But when it happens, it happens. Yo, like that. Yo, that. That earlier. Like, oh my god. No. See, see. Look at this. Bro, don't don't go over. Don't go over. Don't go over. Please. They getting arrested. I swear to God. Ain't no way. Two cops. That's the worst, though. Like, are you if you get stopped by one cop and another cop shows up, guaranteed you're getting a ticket. You're getting frisked also. Like, I, I don't know why. It's just I, I, two cops come along with, like, the weird vibe of getting frisked. But, yeah, like, yo, I the last time I ever got a ticket, I think it was, like, oh, we can bypass. Yes. Uh, last time, man, I think it was like 10, 10 years ago. That was like a, I, I don't know if I like calls it on my, I think I calls it on myself, but um, I came out of the gas station. I had my uh, all motor Acura RSX. Um, it made around like 230, 240. Um, came out of the gas station and I was like, hmm, I'm gonna go do a pull. But the thing was, like, I made sure I looked left and right, and there was a cop at the light. But the thing was, he was turning right at the light. So I'm like, all right, cool. I'm going to sit here and wait a little bit. And he turned, and I immediately just, like, all right, got back on the road. And I did a nasty first to fourth, like, easily 100 mile an hour. But this was, like, on the way to the neighborhood. I know it's, don't break the law. Do the speed limit. But... On the way to the neighborhood, long stretch of road, long enough, um, quick 100 mile an hour, all of a sudden, like, I'm slowing down already halfway to the neighborhood, and dude decides to, like, run up, like, drive super fast, and then turn on his lights. I'm like, yo, what in the world? So, long story short, I don't know how he saw me, but he gave me a ticket for, uh, 10 miles over 10, 10 miles an hour over and I was like I'll take it I don't know how he saw me I think he like got out the gas like he made the right and then quickly went through the gas station and then come down the road I was on but I I know he the, the radar said I was doing 10 miles over I was like hey I'll take it because what I tell you felony speeds is bad you get, you get a quick court date or locked up, like, especially on the way to the neighborhood, but never again. I calmed down a lot, especially when I had the other race car. I had a 1,000 horsepower Civic that I built in the garage. The car was full gutted, but um, it was in the process of getting, like, the full interior and stuff put in and get repainted, but after I broke my fourth gear, doing like a crazy pull, um, yeah, I was like, you know what, sell it. Not sell it, but part it out. Um, I parted out, and then I was like, man, let me get a motorcycle. So, 
got me a motorcycle and now I'm back into cars and I got another Civic so sure, we'll, we'll get there they will get there this was gonna be dang, I can't stay oh it's bright bro like god but yeah this one this one uh I was gonna do like oh thousand horsepower street take it to meets and stuff but I think I'm gonna dial this back because the thousand horsepower one is the one that I just bought. And that's that. Oh, I gotta get off. Yo, 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 bro. Please. Let me go. Let me go over. I'm about to block the highway. Watch this. Hard turn. Hard turn. Hard turn. Oh. Oh. Yo, could have flipped. But yeah, the, the, the car I just bought. Um, that video is coming soon. Like. I need to be able to, I need to be able to like do a couple more things before I even want to show it on camera. But that one's going to be a thousand horsepower, um, daily driver. No, not really daily driver. Cause we got another car that I usually take to work, but thousand horsepower, um, four seater European banger. Don't even think about racing me because it's, it's over. Just, uh, snap your neck. This thing like uh, zero to 60 in three seconds. Um, oh, I already put on my blinker. Zero to 60 in like three seconds. Um, with this, the setup that I want to do, uh, I want to do everything custom. I'm a custom guy. I don't like off the, off the shelf stuff. It's like everybody making the same power. No, nah, not me, not me. I built a thousand horsepower Civic in the garage on the floor, like, and the thing, uh, I drove that to work more than, uh, the new car I got at the time was a 2017 Honda Accord. I drove the Civic more to work than the Accord ever even driven. And it was fun though. Like, you got a thousand horsepower car that could take you from point A to point B to work, to the gas station, grocery store and go out and race on Fridays and Saturdays and then keep doing it over and over for two years, yo, you can't ask for a better build. But it only had two seats and a dash and factory seat belts. Death trap. I'm telling you. But yeah, this build, this build's going to be nasty. Um, thousand horsepower European car. Shoot. Uh, if we can get more, because I've seen some 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 BMWs be doing 1500 horsepower I'm like man, if I can make this boat 1500 horsepower it's got a good motor in it um I don't want to give away the motor cuz the same motors in a couple like I think like two high end no two other high end vehicles Y'all see, y'all see soon, soon. I really need to get a video, but I need to, um, I maybe want to put a different side skirt on it and upgrade the turbos. Um, not no, not no direct swap from another vehicle or stage one. We, we going, yeah, we, we doing it. We doing it. We're, we're going to make some power, uh, right off the bat, 800, nothing less. Oh crap, man! We are here at FedEx. Man, that was a that was even a bad drive. Let's see if I got another. Man, man, this this Freightliner, good stuff. All right, so I don't know which way. Which way am I gonna pull? Oh, I see. We gon' we gon' get this uh, these car videos going soon. I love I love gaming. It's just like man, when you you're playing by yourself, you gotta make things interesting. And it is it is hard, but at the same time, it's not. Like if you if you can have fun by yourself, man, you'll never be bored in your life. Park this thing. Look at that! Look at that! Look at that! Clean, clean, so clean. And stop. You know what? 
We're gonna dump it. And we are here. We are here. Hey, yo, this Freightliner is nasty. Anybody that think they have a better Freightliner than me, yo, pull up. Like, yo, let me know. Let me know. Like, you, you have to send me some pictures because you can't get better than this. Nice, clean. It's a, it's a grayish blue. Um, look at the fenders. Detail, detail. Look at the bumper. Detail. You got the quarter fender back there clean for this this type of truck and then you got the uh the arrow kit look at that it's still got the uh look at that look at that so nice simple simple just simple simple and clean fat stacks fat stacks this is nice but thanks for kicking with me uh again and again man thanks for the people that watch your video um we're gonna we're gonna keep putting out more content man things been things been hectic We've been busy, but content's coming. Content's coming. We got more games. I was going to get Flight Simulator 2024, but the amount of bugs that I've seen in that game, oh, I don't know. I don't know. We'll stick with the whole Flight Simulator, but we're going to get a Flight Sim video up soon because I'm going to take off for a ride. We're going to try to go to another country. Let's see how long that takes. But... Thanks for kicking with me. I really appreciate y'all. And see y'all next time. Peace.